Hi, my name is Jonas, and I thought I'd just drop by and post a little video with the uh, decals that I've been working with for bullet holes. And uh, thank you to Jackie who helped me out with this. Uh, so, yeah, Jackie, here's the result I came up with so far. Uh, it's got a lot of uh, stuff that needs to be done still, but uh, I think it's still it's it's a, it's a workable. So let's take a quick look at it. Okay, so here we have our character and if we shoot at something, we get a little puff of smoke and we have the muzzle flash going. And what else do we have? We have a noisy cricket gun here. Uh, let me turn this off. Um, Alright, so boom 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 boom. And if we come really, really close to this, um, we can see that they are, uh, they are in fact black in the center now. And that is actually what I had a lot of trouble with. So I will also quickly show the material that uh, Jackie helped me out with. Uh, here we have a, just a texture sampler uh, with this little texture. And uh, this is the, the opacity map, the alpha. And this is just a constant one into roughness, and this is just a normal. I actually think didn't really make any difference if I just put in a one constant one into this, but I have no idea why that would make any difference if it did, because I this is completely new to me. Um, also. In here we have deferred decal and we have this uh, debuffer translucent color normal roughness. Uh, normal roughness, yes, that's what we came up with. Um, and in order for all this to actually mean anything, uh, we need to come into project settings, I think, somewhere on the rendering. And Need to take set this early C pass to opaque and mask meshes, and what was the other thing? Uh, movable in early C pass, and last thing was hmm, I can't, oh yeah, deep buffer decals, this one. So these three settings needs to be set and then restart uh, Unreal Engine. And with this material, it should work. So if anybody is interested in how I spawn the material uh, or the decal, it's quite, yeah, well, there's a lot of spaghetti in here. I'm not done with this, but it's, just uh, basically a spawn decal at location, has to have some size, have a location at where the hit lands, and the rotation I'm still working on. Um, so right now it just gets uh, the normal, and I turn a little bit to make it uh, um, look correct, <laughs> and then I plug it into the rotation and. Ideally, I wanted to kind of uh, tilt, uh, depending on the angle, but that's another story. I don't really know if I, I need to go into that right now. Um, and the hit smoke is here. Spawn that afterwards. Uh, just a standard little smoke thingy. And the gun sound is here. Play sound at location, which I turned down to zero now. And here with the mus muscle flash, spawn that at the location of the gun. And what else do we have? Um, yeah, well, I had I had a little uh, trouble figuring out how to to make this uh, direction of the gun, what which direction would I shoot at, what point, and so on. Because uh, when I'm in first person. And right now the gun is actually not pointing at the center of the screen, uh, but 
this actually gives it the uh, is actually shooting out from the the way of the um, the direction of the gun uh, contrary to the direction um, of the camera uh, yeah so um, anyway it's something I m might change later on but it seems kind of logical uh, to do it this way so yeah that's basically it. I uh, might go more into detail once this is done. I wanted to post this because I think it's kind of promising at this point. <clears throat> so uh, thank you and bye.